Okay, so what's up guys? Uh, today we actually have a very cute car. It's a 2018 Suzuki Jimny, uh, the new model. The previous model, I don't really like it. It doesn't really look as good. I have to say, this car is really tiny, but it looks really muscular. It, it, yeah, it's just a really nice car. Okay, this is the key. Really old fashioned, actually the same key as the previous uh, Jimny. Uh, this is also my own car. I uh, use it in Germany. Uh, I live in the Netherlands, but in Germany, yeah. With this KO2 BF Goodrich tires, it's off road. Just we have a Raptor uh, F150 Raptor as well, but yeah, off road just really doesn't keep up with this. This thing is just amazing. Okay, um, first of all, what things have I done to it? Um, I installed a hood visor. Don't know why, but yeah, it looks uh, pretty cool. Uh, I installed this front bumper, actually the same color as the car itself. I installed these um, fog lights, uh, the lights in here. Uh, these are actually stock ones, but I plan to uh, change those as well. So then it's all uh, LED. Now is this, um, yeah, this one stock not that great uh, other thing i installed a winch never used it but it's nice that it's on there okay the other thing the car is not uh, lifted this is just a uh, uh, stock height but i installed these wheels and the tires of course but the wheels just look a little bit better stock they are silver i uh, yeah i just think black looks a lot better these tires, you can buy better tires than the, yeah, maybe the uh, Ridge Grapplers from Nitto. Those are a bit the same. These tires just drive really well on the road and off-road, you can't really beat them. The other thing, we have a roof rack. <laughs> the thing that's really funny with this car is actually the suspension is so stuffed. I can touch with two fingers and the whole car is moving. If I take my hand, I, I almost, it feels like I can flip it over. It's just a really light car, but that, that's, yeah, it's fine. One thing, um, really nice sunset, but this car really looks like a G-Wagon. A Mercedes G-Wagon. Prove me, <laughs> prove me wrong, but really, the G-Wagon really also has this little rain line. And it just, yeah, it's just a boxy, boxy shape. Auto thing, uh, yeah, spare tire. Have a little uh, step, so can you get on the roof? Little recon antenna right there. Nice touch. Um, the thing is, because this car uh, is really boxy, you actually have a lot of space. Uh, we have a little rubber mat here, but actually there are some, uh, how do you call them, seats <laughs> under here. You actually do sit really well in the back, but I just don't really use it. So a little storage here, as you can see it's uh, used pretty well. Uh, we have a net here, you can uh, put some stuff on it. A little table actually, that you can flip over. Don't know why it's in there, you don't really use it, but it's really funny. Little bags right here, all stuff you can lay in it. Yeah, just this door alone just looks like the door from a G-Wagon. <laughs> it's just really crazy. What is this actually? Oh, nice, okay. Uh, the other thing, I installed some new uh, brake lights. Actually have the little uh, Audi LEDs as you can see yeah that's just a stupid touch but <laughs> it looks really pretty funny if you ask me um, uh, this is a switch for the winch uh, roof lights we don't have those roof lights but these are for the front couldn't get another switch uh, this for lap bar lap bar yeah lane keep assist but it's really stupid in this car the steering uh, wheel just starts to vibrate doesn't work that well uh, the other thing 
I should show you guys the engine bay. Yeah, it's not really that special. Up. Just a little tiny cute engine. Um, one thing I have to say on the highway, if you drive um, about 60 miles an hour, that's around 100 kilometers an hour, it just feels if you're going too on it. It's just crazy. All the wind noise, uh, everything vibrating. The engine is really screaming for help. But yeah, it's really meant for off-roading, not for the highway. So, yeah, just look at it. It it just looks cute, but rugged as well. Yeah, just really funny. Other thing, uh, I have the automatic gearbox, which is re really special in the U.S. It's just a funny car. Also the grab handles, just like a G-Wagon. Uh, pretty sturdy, I have to say. <laughs> As you can see, the whole car is moving. <laughs> That's just crazy. Um, it's actually a four-speed automatic. Yeah, that's just crazy, but drives fine. I installed this little armrest. That's um, a shame that it's not stuck, but nice to have it. You can only lay one arm on it because it's pretty small, but works fine to me. Uh, some speakers in the doors, really small as well, but also works fine for me. Uh, my phone holder, Let's actually sit there because I can't really drive here. So, so uh, actually heated seat, pretty good. Uh, too high, four high, four low. You can shift it to the back. Uh, I installed these. Let me show you. These uh, pedal extenders, because um, the normal pedals are just really small, and if you uh, you actually have boots on or something, it's yeah, just all the way, all times slipping off, just not great. So these much better, more grip, a lot larger. Oh. So one thing that is really irritating me, as soon as you put the key in here. Oh, not now? Really? Is the oh, look. It's now. This is just really, really irritating. If you're in this car and you actually put the key in it, immediately starts beeping. This is just so freaking annoying. Oh, is the door closed? That, then it's fine. So, let's start this muscle up. One thing that's really funny about this car, you don't, you really don't hear it. You just, you have no exhaust noise. There's literally none. This is crazy, but pretty nice. Yeah, that's one thing I uh, nice that it's showing right there. Look at this freaking fuel economy. For this small of a car, this is really bad. 11 kilometers per liter. Well, uh, what the hell, Suzuki? Just crazy. So, put my seatbelt on for this fast, fast car. <laughs> no, but uh, AC also working. Pretty nice. You actually hear it. <laughs> I'd never hear that in a car, but here it does because yeah, the doors are really small, really light not really that good dampened okay really nice gauges all looks it looks really rugged let's say that so yeah it just drives funny i don't know what it is but off-road this car is really really good 
I uh, will go to the right here if I can. Yes, I can. Um, and we're going for a little drive on the road. And then I'm taking a ride for the off-road. So. Yeah, you hear literally every bump in this car. You hear it. Not really want to say you feel it, but it's actually pretty comfortable. Yeah, <laughs> nice four cylinder, let's go. No, but for real, um, the steering of this car is crazy. Look at this. I'm doing this and I'm still going right just forward. Just in a right lane, what the fuck? <laughs> but if you do this, yeah, then it's a little bit different. That's better. So, I'm going to the right here. There's something smoking right there. So, maybe we can spot some deer out here. Uh, you also have a, um, a low. Now it's just drive, high. You also have a low and a two, then it's constantly keeping it in two. Uh, you have a little <laughs> button right here that's named power remote. I don't really understand the power they said that it should be done, but yeah, if I press it, look, I see it there. Wow, wow, this thing is fast. <laughs> No, no, not really. Not really that fast. But as you can see, it actually handles this stuff pretty fine. I know this is not really off-road course or something, but it's a little detour. Hi, horsey. It handles it pretty well. For this car is just so small. It's just great. It's just crazy. Nice bump. It just rained here last night, so it's some stuff is a bit wet. But that's no problem for this car. Nothing, nothing is <laughs> stopping this one. No, it's uh, it's really. Yeah, I just like it. I like it. Pretty fun, fun to drive car. And the one thing is really good about this car is actually all the windows are just straight up. So it's just, yeah. You, the visibility you get with this thing, really good. It just feels like you're in a buggy or something. Just a little four by four buggy. Nice view. Wow, <laughs> yeah, that's not uh, that uh, specular, little nice bridge. Really nice that it's automatic, that's just really great. Just look at this freaking weather. Oh, that's a little cool skelter. Just a fun car. Actually, everybody just waves at you. Uh, yeah, there's people I wave back, but everybody just likes this car because it's just funny looking it's just uh yeah i don't know it just looks funny i think i'm going for a ride yeah i think that's better okay now we got some real speed <laughs> no not really but it's it's trying its best <laughs> let's say it. just let's say that 
it's doing its best to keep up but actually these seats are really comfortable but as you can see it's a <laughs> that's just crazy the body roll of this thing is just it feels like you're gonna fall over now I'm gonna shut up for a little moment so you can hear this great exhaust note <laughs> just want to oh that's a duck i almost just want to take take over that car <laughs> i just nice real race car man <laughs> oh this thing is just funny nice little radio yeah just everything is actually on this car uh one thing that's really a shame um the new ones of this model, uh, they don't make it with the back seats anymore. Because, um, yeah, the fuel economy and this thing is just not efficient. Uh, and yeah, you all, all only can get this on uh, with a little bit, uh, yeah, how you call it? A rack? No. Uh, our, about a cage behind your seat. That's just really a bummer because you can't eat. Your seat just is yeah crazy straight. Uh, this seat you can uh, lay a little bit back so you can sit a little bit relaxed. In that car you're just sitting like this. That's just stupid. But yeah. Regulations. Nice little B road. Yeah. <laughs> The power in this thing. Wow. <laughs> no, it's fine. It's not bad. As I would subscribe yeah, unscribe it. Uh, one thing guys, don't forget to subscribe and like this video. Uh, also put the bell icon on. So if I uh, post a new video, you of course also get it. Man, I just want to race through these corners. <laughs> nah. I actually don't know where I'm going. But I think that's fine. Ah, it just said Einde Varde Straat. That means you're going on some off-road stuff. I think. I hope so. Oh, wait. Uh, not really. Uh, don't know what I'm doing here. Oh, I can go back to the road. So... I'm actually gonna end the video right here. So. so, I just wanna thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. <laughs> look at these lights. <laughs> just looks funny. Okay, don't forget to subscribe and see you on the next one. Bye.